Get ready to go. You know what I'm saying? Hike, hike to GC. It's code for Grand Canyon. And uh, we're ready to do this thing, you know? It's all good. Well said. On a scale of 1 to 10, how early is it right now? Um, what, what, 10 being the, the <laughs> latest in the day? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, let's just arbitrarily pick five, okay? Right. Hey, I'm Brett. Some people call me the Amtrucker. Really? I'm just a guy with a list. I left my home, I left my job, and now I'm traveling the country with nothing but a backpack full of technology and a whole lot of faith in the kindness of strangers. I don't spend any money on lodging, which makes for some interesting nights, and I'm not going home until everything is crossed off the list. Call me a nomad, call me a vagrant, or call me Amtrucker. Hey team, welcome to Amtrekker. Apparently these folks are all looking to leave me behind. No one can wait for the cameraman nowadays. What is with these people? What? We're only about a fifth of the way down, but this place is absolutely spectacular. No one's waiting for me at all. My parents are a little bit further behind up there somewhere. Everyone else is probably a mile ahead of me already. First thoughts on the Grand Canyon? Rocks. <laughs> oh, no, 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 literally and figuratively. Any thoughts on the Grand Canyon, Cody? Sweet, it's good times. Good people, good times, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> How far down does this trail go? All the way? That's my first glimpse of it. It's, it's like nothing I've ever seen before. It's, I've never seen anything like it before. Alright, this is the three mile mark, one third of the way down. Anyone have any special thoughts? Anyone hurting? Does a duct tape tell you anything? <laughs> Why are you duct taping your feet? Preventative. What? It's preventative. Preventative duct tape. Katie? So I got, huh? I envisioned in my mind this feat that I could never complete, and since we're halfway, it's really exciting. I made it a really big point to say goodbye to my mom before. <laughs> Being like, hug, called my sisters. Yeah. I think the Colorado River shrunk. Just like that. Oh, you see that? Masterful. How's that feel? It feels really refreshing. Oh. Oh. Like every time you turn a corner, it's a different place. Yeah. Whoa. And every time you fall off the cliff, you die. Good to remember. Huh? This is like Stand By Me. Yeah. Dibs on not being uh, that fat kid. Ooh, it sways too, that's fun. Oh, they made it. How much would it suck if this thing actually broke right now? Here it is, you can't get any closer to the bottom of the Grand Canyon than this. The Colorado River. It's amazing how much this river is made. Or destroyed, depending on how you look at it. Either way, this place is phenomenal. So we made it. We're on the bottom of the canyon. It was tough, but not that tough for most of us. These were pretty bad. Big, bad, strong <laughs> men. <laughs> we made it to the bottom! Who's excited? Cody, who's excited? You are. You're excited, Brett. And me. Get shown differently. Hey team, this is day two at the Grand Canyon and it's the crack of dawn right now and we're gonna start heading back up. Make it up about halfway today, camp again, and then all the way out tomorrow. It's gonna be awesome! So apparently, we're supposed to keep walking up this. Park ranger said the elevator was out or it was never built, something like that. It was hard to tell because I think he was delirious from all this ridiculous heat. Hey pal, 
How's your day going? Enjoying the canyon? You like it here? I think it's pretty. What do you think? No? Did you just shake your head no? That'd be a little bit creepy. This is our campground. We paid for it. Stupid nature. So we're kind of loud because we're playing spoons and we've already had the ranger come and tell us once. But uh, it's just too much fun. And mom doesn't have any idea what she's doing. <laughs> Apparently he thinks he can run the whole way. We all know that once he rounds the corner, he's gonna be laying on his back, wheezing. Woo! We made it to the top, and I beat Katie! Woo! Cause he cheated. Oh, oh I'm an Iron Man. He tried I'm to Katie. push people, I'm so cool. innocent people I won. off the I won. edge. I won. Small children off the edge to beat me. I don't <laughs> think that's very nice. Yes. It was good. It feels like I accomplished something. Something small. Something small, yeah. Cause it's kinda of sissy. It was pretty sissy. We, we really should go look for the ultimate canyon. For all those who don't know, we just climbed almost a mile straight up. It was nothing. Nothing. Easy. Although, there's something to be said for climbing a mountain and then being able to walk down when you're done. Instead of climbing into a big hole and having to walk out. Agreed. So this is my tip. Music, the last 1.5 miles, it rocks. Awesome, huh? do you just feel like full of life? It's the eighth wonder of the world, what can I say? <laughs> the canyon's one of the seven, but making it up out of there was a wonder. <laughs> yeah, I would say it's worth it. I owe it to the Amtrekker and his list. It's a place I never would have seen from the rim, most likely much less the Colorado. And it's my opinion, after doing it, you gotta stay at the top or go to the bottom. <laughs> Anything in between is a waste of effort. You'll make it to a bathroom, turn around, come back, and you might as well see it from right here on the top. Yeah. Good if point. you're not going to go to the bottom. Mom? Anything? Just heavy breathing? Just heavy breathing. <laughs> I'm so glad I did it though.